The next thing that we're going to learn is how to add some B-rolls into the timeline and to position them within our clip or within our timeline or within the video clip. So let's kind of zoom in out, zoom in this one so we can see clearly what we are dealing with. So zoom in, I want to add some B-rolls. I have imported them from the previous uh, tutorial. I've shown you how to import. In case if you don't have it imported, you can always right click and uh, go ahead and import from file file app you can just navigate and import so i've imported mine so let's start with the images you can just drag and drop the image just like so and drop it in the timeline wherever you specify okay so you can just select it and you can move it around if you want to specify exactly where you want to position it so once you have the video clip you have your b-roll enabled you can see it just move from the video up to this and then back to where i'm talking okay so this is just uh, b-roll so you can increase or decrease the length by selecting it you can increase or decrease the length of it from here or you can increase it also from the other edge over here Okay, until you are satisfied and you can do some basic cuttings also from here so you can do basic cutting assuming you want to uh, create a cut at this point you just select and move around maybe you want to create a cut at this point you want the video the b-roll to stop here so you can just create a cut or you can press on letter s as well and it's going to create that cut so you select the other portion and delete it you can come over to the other edge over here so for just assuming i want to create another cut here I just come over here and just click on the letter uh, press on letter s and it created the split you can select the other edge and you can delete from here as well so you can see you've deleted so from here me talking it just it just quickly move into the b-roll from me to be the b-roll and then it stays on the b-roll while i explained on the background and then back to me talking so you can see everything and Another thing you can do with the bureau is you can do a number of things like the flipping. You can flip around, you can flip, you can mirror around and you can create a feel as well. You can create a mask and you can move backward if you want. So you can rotate as well from here. You can rotate at any angle. Okay, You can go ahead and rotate if you so wish. And you can duplicate from here or you can create keyframes at any given point and attach different properties if you want so i do mean this is how to import an image you can import the other image also maybe i want to specify it at this point you can just drag and drop it here and you can specify the location and whatever you want you can rotate you can select and you can reduce the sizing from here or you can just show it or you can select and bring it to this side and it just pops in while I'm explaining. So for example, I click out and then from, from me talking, all of a sudden the media will, will, will just pop in. So from me talking, okay, so the media pops in and then it pops out. So you can bring in your B-roll at any given point and you can have them play around with it. So this is images. You can do the same with videos as well. So let's say we select Let's say we click out and then we come to the video. I want to ins insert this video. I can just easily drag it and drop it on the timeline. Okay, very easily, just like we have done with the images. You can move around as well and you can see the video. It just to get placed with the ice cream. So you can see uh, it comes in and then it goes out. So you can specify the length as well. You can zoom in out. You can and you can select from here and create a, a cut. Maybe you want the the point to start at where this girl becomes uh, super happy. So for example, uh, let's say from here, once you raise, she becomes so happy. Okay, at this point, I create a card. So you just select the bureau and then you can split it. Okay, create a split and then you can select the other edge and you can delete from here or you can press and delete on your keyboard to kind of delete it. So you can see the starting point. So from this to me talking and then to the girl be become surprised and then back to this feature. Okay, so and you can select and move it around is also if you want, you can move it around across to anywhere you want. For example, you may want it to have me talking, okay, then to the B-roll and then back to me talking and then we can continue. So this is how to bring in B-rolls in terms of video and you equally have the same features that you can work with you can uh, put in fix you can trim okay you can trim from both edges like we've explained how to do trimming you can crop around yeah you can crop from the edges you can just select or you can click on cropping and it will give you the opportunity to crop you can crop around you can rotate from this 
Okay, you can see you can rotate at different angles. I rather keep it at zero, and you can select free cropping like you've made. You can make it to any of these. Okay, free cropping. You can crop around. You can select free cropping, and then you can move it around to select a given portion that you actually want to target. Okay, so you can select maybe the girl's face. And you can just go ahead and, and target this and once you hit on this it's going to take in this feature or you can do three by four or you can do four by five for instagram or you can do 19 by 16 by 9 for for youtube but i usually rather go with the original but this is just to show you how to play around with the different rotation features and once you click on this it's you know back to the normal one the cropping features so you can do quite a lot in terms of the adding video bureaus okay so you can move around also maybe you want to add this one as another b-roll you can just select it drag it and drop it on the timeline and you can do some basic editing extension uh, or the about you can extend okay to have it cover the areas that you want you can see you can select you can edit you can position uh, accordingly however you want it okay so this is adding bureau to the timeline and doing some basic editing within vn video editor i think that does it for this tutorial thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next one